Congratulations to all the graduates of the class of 2020. I just want to say how proud we are of you and of everything you guys have accomplished. And it's been a great joy watching everyone grow up to be the great young men and women that you have become. And as you guys move on to the next chapter in your life, some words of advice. Keep working hard. Enjoy life. Buy a pair of shoes here or there. And again, congratulations. Great job, everyone. Hi everyone, just wanted to say congratulations to our 2020 seniors. I wanted to share some words of wisdom to you guys. And I know you may have not have walked uh, this year, but this will definitely be an unforgettable event and year. Um, this event has made everybody stronger. It has made everybody patient and continue to strive for greatness and make sure that you guys are taking care of yourselves and please stop by the club um, whenever you guys can and come visit us. I know a lot of the staff enjoy seeing you guys so definitely uh, we miss you guys. And hey guys it's Ish from the Boys and Girls Club of Santa Cruz Valley. Just wanted to take this time to say congratulations to our 2020 seniors for finally graduating high school. We hope you guys do very well in whatever field you guys go into. We will miss you guys. And my one piece of advice would be do not procrastinate. Whatever assignments, whatever projects are assigned to you, just get it over with so that you are able to hang out with your friends and family and not worry about that project that you have to get done tomorrow, all right? Hi, Boys and Girls Club graduates. I just wanted to come on and give a big congratulations. Whether you're moving from sixth to seventh grade or eighth to ninth grade or 12th to trade school, a job, college, I just want to remind you to stay true to who you are you're all amazing individuals and we're so lucky to have you as members of our club. Um, you know, as you go through different walks of life, you're going to constantly be learning new things, but always look back on the memories you have and the friends that you have and stay true to what's gotten you there so far. So just wanted to let you guys know that. That's my advice. Bye. Hey seniors, um, one piece of advice that I would give you guys as you start your new chapter after high school is to take a wide variety of courses while you're in college, your first and second year. That way you can see um, what your interests might be and that way you can submit your major on what you want to do instead of what you feel like you should do. And once you graduate, you can do something that you really love. Hey guys, it's Marky from the Newhall Boys and Girls Club. I just wanted to congratulate the seniors and the class of 2020 for everything that they have accomplished. Um, your guys' hard work has paid off and I can't wait to see what you guys are going to be doing next. Um, my quick tip for you guys is to always stay in touch with your friends. You guys are going on your own separate paths right now, so it's really important to communicate and just be there for, for people that are going through it. So um, you want to be there for your friends just like you want them to be there for you. So always stay in touch with the people that matter to you. Hey guys, it's Richard from Service the Boys and Girls Club. I just want to give a special shout out to our graduating class of 2020 and just thank you all you seniors for all the hard work you put in this year. Obviously it's been a very typical year dealing with all the different things that have happened, but I just want to give you guys some words of encouragement and just a little bit of advice heading into college. Obviously this college experience is going to be much different than most seniors are accustomed to, but the one piece of advice I'd give you is just always come prepared. Always make sure that you guys have what you need, the supplies you need, and just come mentally prepared because that's the half of the battle right there. Thank you so much, and I hope you guys have a great college experience. Hey guys, it's Marlene. Congratulations, you guys did it, and we are so proud of you. You guys, it wasn't easy, but you're here, and it's something to feel accomplished about. Celebrate yourselves. You guys are amazing. Remember to fight for what is right and be true to yourselves. Remember to be kind to the planet, each other, and yourself, most importantly. Have fun and just enjoy the journey. Congratulations, graduates of 2020. Be proud of what you accomplished throughout this four years of high school, and we are proud of you for sticking through this hard time. Remember to have fun, stay safe, and celebrate. We'll miss you guys. Congrats, class of 2020. You made it. It's only up from here. Keep shining and push it through. We're all so proud of you, and the club is always here. Time flies. Good news is you're the pilot. You may think at times that your dreams are impossible to achieve. Hey guys, uh, here are some words of encouragement uh, from me, uh, be your staff. Uh, pause, take a deep breath in, exhale, and repeat after me. I am enough. I am worthy. I am deserving. 
I am doing the best that I can with the resources that I have at this time. My current situation is not my final destination. Please take care of yourselves and be kind to yourselves. Thank you guys. I love you. Hello guys. Well, it's that time. To Yubia, Geneva, and Marissa, and even those whose names I don't remember at this point because I don't, I've forgotten. I want you to know that I consider it an honor and a privilege to have known you and your families and played an active role in nurturing and helping you be better people and better citizens. I think some of the best advice I can give you at this point as you prepare to move forward this year is have your priorities in place and have those priorities straight. Putting God first and your family second and your academics third. And anybody that's in your space that's not trying to go in that same direction with you, you may have to push that person to the side. But I think the best piece of advice I can give you as it relates to family, trust your parents with every single solitary thing that you go through, good or bad. And if it's bad and you know that it's going to upset them, tell them anyway. Because the one thing that you can always count on is that they love you. You can count on that. Again, God bless you. Blessings upon you and your families. Bye now. Hey kids, welcome to my backyard. And uh, I'm here to congratulate all you graduates on making it through this obstacle. Um, you're, you've done it, you're finally out, and the whole world is ahead of you. And although I know right now it doesn't seem like the world is a very good place, um, things are gonna get better. And I want you to remember that this is the time of your life where your actions are going to create ripples of change. So think about the things you believe in. Think about what you don't like about the world as it is today, and then start working towards changing that. Um, I used to tell some, when I used to teach in Korea, uh, you know, they have a big, um, a big sad history between North Korea and South Korea and I used to tell my kids because I would teach them about this history and I would say don't get sad because you're the one writing the next chapter. The ending hasn't come yet and the same thing has to say for what we're going through in America right now. The story's not over. You're going to be the ones writing it. So my best advice to you as a writer and as an American is make this ending a good one. We're counting on you, and we believe in you, and we know you got what it takes. With all my heart, all my love, congratulations class of 2020. You're gonna be the best generation yet. See ya. Hey you guys, this is Joey. I just wanted to let you guys know um, you guys made it. You know, congratulations. And you want you guys to continue to keep up the good work. You know it's a lot of things going on right now that you know may seem a little bit crazy but at the same time you guys have that power to change what's going on and you guys continue to put your best foot forward and you know you know you look at this as this is history as you guys are living in and understand that you guys have a chance to really make history and change what's happening at this point in time um, you know whatever this is that's going on, you know, you guys keep your head up, and most of all, you know, maintain focus, and continue to do what's right, you know, whether it feels that you're going to be criticized or looked at different, just continue to do what's right, and your life will come out beautiful, you know, um, I just wanted to give another congratulations to you guys, and understand that you guys did a good job, and, you know, may, may the next year be way better than this year. At the same time, you guys continue to stay focused and um, be careful and stay safe. All right, bye. Hi guys, Zuli here from the New Hall site. I just wanted to take this time and say congratulations for finally graduating. You guys did it. 
I know it wasn't the easiest year, but you guys still managed to make it through. And I just wanted to let you know that I am so proud of each and every one of you. And I wish you nothing but the best of luck on this new chapter. Keep going. You guys got this. Remember, we're always here for you. And once again, congratulations. Here's to the class of 2020. <laughs>